He's one of the most sought-after actors in Hollywood, starred in some of the biggest sci-fi and action franchises of all time. He's got an impressive net worth of 350 million bucks, and he just so happens to be a big-time motorcyclist, a passion he has brought to the screen quite a few times. So with all that cash and a deep love of motorcycles, what are the bikes that Mr. Reeves has in his garage? What makes the cut to be a part of Neo's motorcycle collection that, when totaled up, goes for over $450,000? Today we are looking at the impressive and also expensive bike collection of Keanu Reeves. We're sure after today's video, you'll be saying, whoa. If you think that Keanu Reeves, who stars in the uber-successful Matrix franchise, which has grossed a total of $1.632 billion in total, doesn't have the iconic bike seen in the second film The Matrix Reloaded, well, you need to wake up, my friend. Reeves has the limited edition Matrix Reloaded green Ducati, which sports the iconic green color from the movie, and also happens to have the name The Matrix Reloaded printed on the side. The bike was ridden by Carrie Ann Moss in the freeway escape scene, and according to Reeves, Miss Moss had never Ever ridden a motorcycle before making the film. Reeves claims he still takes the bike out for a spin now and again, and we don't blame him. After all, once you unplug, there's no turning back. The price for this collectible? 15695 bucks. Up next, we want to show you Keanu's Arch Method 143. If you didn't know, Arch Motorcycle Company, LLC, is a custom American motorcycle manufacturer, which was founded by Keanu Reeves and Gard Hollinger in 2011. This was the second bike produced by Arch Motorcycle. So, as you can imagine, a bike like the Arch Method 143 has a special place in Mr. Reeves' heart. It's the first concept motorcycle built with a carbon fiber monocell chassis and utilized is fine leather, carbon fiber, and aluminum in the body to create one of the most beautiful bikes ever constructed. You want one? Good luck. Only 23 were ever produced, which probably explains the asking price of $78,000. Here's one that will leave your jaw on the floor. It's the Norton Commando 750. Reeves loves the brand and has owned bikes by them before. Norton, wanting to show off the fact that an A-list Hollywood star loves their bikes, reposted some photos of Reeves in 2012 cruising in West Hollywood on the Commando 750. Hey, we don't blame them. Unfortunately, the bike was involved in a minor accident when a woman backed her Mercedes into the bike when it was parked. Reeves, ever the nice guy, simply smiled, took her information, and drove off. What a guy! The Norton Commando 750 goes for 11057 bucks. if you're thinking of picking one up. Up next, we got another bike produced by Mr. Reeves' motorcycle company, Arch Motorcycles. This is his Arch KRGT-1. What's especially cool about this bike is that each one is customized specifically for their individual rider. So if you get one, it'll truly be your bike. It's touted as a performance cruiser, meaning it does particularly well on long rides, but also will stand up to a bit of force. Arch Motorcycles has continually improved on the KRGT-1's design since its release in 2015. Case in point, in 2018, it was remodeled with a 48mm fork and a new tank shape. It's a bit pricey, though, at $85,000, but for Keanu, that's chump change. Reeves' Harley-Davidson Dyna Wide Glide is the next bike in his collection we want to show off. It's a motorcycle that was produced from 1991 to 2017, and believe it or not, this was the bike that Reeves had customized by his future business partner in Arch Motorcycles, Gard Hollinger. The blueprints they came up with became the foundation for the aforementioned Arch KRGT-1. But Keanu never forgot the bike that gave him that inspiration, and that's why it's in his collection. How much did Keanu pay for it? Around $16,949. Another Harley also graces Mr. Reeves' collection. Check out this 1984 Harley-Davidson Shovelhead. It's considered an absolute classic, so we really aren't surprised that someone who is as big a fan of motorcycles as Keanu Reeves has one in his collection. Hey, there's a reason this is the bike that captures newcomers' hearts and makes them want to trade in their sedans for a Harley. It's just awesome. The Shovelhead goes for around $10,000. Up next, we have one of Keanu's personal favorites, due to the fact that this was actually his second bike that he ever owned. It's the 1973 Norton Commando 850 MK2 Roadster, and it also doubles as the bike he has owned the longest that's still in his collection. Another fun fact, this bike has a special place in film history, due to the fact that Keanu rode it across America to convince River Phoenix to join the cast of My Own Private Idaho, and he said yes. Nice job, 850. You helped bring two screen legends together. This motorcycle costs 14,500 bucks. Not too shabby, all things considered. Here's Keanu's West Coast Choppers El Diablo. What makes this bike particularly special is the fact that it was custom painted and engraved by the good folks at West Coast Choppers, which is a company owned by none other than Jesse James. Legend has it he actually started marketing his business in high school by selling t-shirts. Getting one of these bikes is rare. James only produces
is a few a year, and you have to be a particularly special client in order to get on that list. Shaquille O'Neal and Kid Rock are just two of the famous celebs out there lucky enough to own one. With this kind of scarcity and exclusivity, you probably won't be surprised to find that Keanu's bike cost him a whopping $150,000. Wow! Next up is the 1974 BMW 750. It's another classic, and any motorbike enthusiast who's worth their weight has heard of this one. While it may come as a bit of surprise that BMW makes bikes in addition to their cars, we'd venture to say that it comes as no surprise that this is allegedly one of the most comfortable rides when it comes to motorcycles. Hey, BMW knows what they're doing. The 750 is an $8,500 bike. Reeves' Moto Guzzi is what we want to show you next. It's Italian made, and while the design is trademarked, we have to say there's a striking similarity between this Moto Guzzi and the design of the Arch motorcycles. Coincidence? We think not. Keanu certainly is paying homage to these beautiful rides with his designs, and frankly, we see why. Their special edition ride goes for $9,490. How could you have a motorcycle collection and not have a Kawasaki in there? We've actually got two to show you. First, here's Keanu's bike of choice, the Kawasaki ZX-10 Ninja. It's got an eye-watering top speed of about 290 kilometers per hour. With performance like that, you won't catch Neo taking this one out on the streets, but you will absolutely see him tear it up on the track. The Kawasaki ZX-10 Ninja goes for $15,399. Not bad at all for that performance. Here's Keanu's Kawasaki 600 Enduro. The bike also has some sentimental value for the A-lister, as apparently it was a Kawasaki that made Mr. Reeves fall in love with bikes in the first place. The story goes that while filming in Europe, a woman who was riding a Kawasaki taught him the basics of riding, and he loved it so much that when he returned to America, he bought his first bike, and it was a Kawasaki. This was years ago, when Reeves was in his 20s. Now he still has the 600 Enduro to keep the memory alive of what got him into bikes in the first place. The 600 Enduro goes for $9,999. The Suzuki GSX R750 is also found in Reeves' collection. It may not be one of the most expensive or luxurious or rare bikes in his collection, but man, does it look cool. We see why the actor keeps one in his garage. This bike can be yours for only $12,499. Finally, we have Mr. Reeves' Kawasaki KZ900. It's a bike that prioritizes comfort over speed, but that very well may be why Keanu has it in his collection. It's all about how the bike feels on the road, after all. And when it comes to reliability, the KZ900 has it where it counts. It's a $16,160 motorcycle. Hey, before we go, have you ever wondered what Keanu's car of choice is? It's a black Porsche 911 Carrera 4S. Apparently, he owned one that was stolen. Then, he went to Porsche directly and got a new custom 911 car that was designed exclusively for him. And that's it for today's video. Thanks for sticking around. We hope you enjoyed learning about Keanu Reeves' awesome motorcycle bike collection. We'll see you next time, right here on The Richest.